Hello everyone, welcome to Static GK quiz number 119. This video is aimed to help you with your central and state government job examinations. I'm Ritrisha from GK today and I'll be taking you through this. Pat Shanama or Chronicles of the Emperor written by Abdul Hamid Lahori is the official visual history giving a detailed account of the reign of which of the following Mughal emperor. The correct answer is Shah Jahan. The Pat Shanama or Chronicles of the Emperor is a genre of works written as the official visual history of Mughal Emperor in Shah Jahan's reign. Most significant work of this genre was written by Abdul Hamid Lahori in two volumes. Bhimbetka in Madhya Pradesh is an ancient Indian site where art of prehistoric age are found preserved in rock shelters. These arts belong to 1. Paleolithic age, 2. Mesolithic age, Three Chagolithic age. Choose the correct option. The drawings and paintings from Bhimbirka can be classified under seven different periods. Upper Paleolithic ones are linear representations in green and dark red of huge figures of animals such as bison, tigers, and rhinoceros. Mesolithic was comparatively small in size. The stylized figures in this group show linear decoration on their body. In addition to animals, there are human figures and hunting scenes, giving a clear picture of the weapons they used. Barbed spears, pointed sticks, bows and arrows. Similarly to the paintings of the Mesolithic, the Chalcolithic drawings reveal that during this period, the cave dwellers of this area were in contact with the agricultural communities of the Malwa plains, exchanging goods with them. So you can see that all three ages are represented. So the correct answer is 1, 2 and 3. Hamim Humam, who was the chief of royal school or Patshala, adorned the court of which Mughal emperor? The correct answer is Akbar. Hamim Humam was one of the Navratnas of Akbar. Navratnas was a term applied to a group of nine extraordinary people in an emperor's court in India. The well-known Navratnas include the ones in the courts of the legendary emperor Vikramaditya, the Mughal emperor Akbar and the feudal lord Raja Krishnachandra. Which Mughal emperor had put a ban on killing of animals in certain days? Akbar had put a ban on killing animals in certain days in the year 1583. Ustad Isa is related to the design and architecture of which of the following buildings in Mughal era? The correct answer is the Taj Mahal. Ustad Isa Shirazi was a Persian architect, often described as the assistant architect of the Taj Mahal in Agra, India. The lack of complete and reliable information as to whom the credit for the design belonged to led to innumerable speculations. Scholars suggest the story of Ustad Isa was born of the eagerness of the British in the 19th century to believe that such a beautiful building should be credited to a European architect. Sud Sagar, a treatise on music, was written during the reign of which of the following Mughal emperors? The correct answer is Akbar. Sud Sagar was written by Sud Das in the 16th century. Sud Das was a blind Hindu devotional poet and singer who was known for his lyrics written in the praise of Krishna. They are usually written in Brajabhasha one of the two literary dialects of Hindi. Babur, the founder of the mighty Mughal Empire, traced his lineage to Taimur from paternal lineage and Chinggis Khan from maternal lineage. Jujhar Singh, who was a Bandela chief, had revolted against Shah Jahan. While many Bandela chiefs served Mughals loyally, Jujhar Singh revolted. In whose times the Mughal Empire reached its territorial climax? If you look at the map, you can see Aurangzeb's reign has the largest area covered. So the correct answer is Aurangzeb. He was a notable expansionist during his reign and the Mughal Empire reached its greatest extent, ruling over nearly all of the Indian subcontinent. During his lifetime, victories in the south expanded the Mughal Empire to 4 million square kilometers and he ruled over a population estimated to be over 158 million subjects with an annual yearly revenue of $450 million in the year 1690. Under his reign, the Mughal Empire 
surpassed China to become the world's largest economy worth over 90 billion, nearly a quarter of the world GDP in 1700s. Akbar had adopted the Ray system of revenue assessment, which he had abolished later as part of his land revenue reforms. Who among the following had introduced the Ray system? The correct answer is Alauddin Khilji. So no change was made till his 10th year, that is Akbar's 10th year of reign, that is 1566, after which it was changed into a single price list. That's all for today's quiz. Until the next video, goodbye.